Hi guys, welcome to SA Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to migrate your operating system to a new drive without the hassle of reinstalling everything from scratches using a powerful and user friendly disk management tool. This is not any paid promotion video. We found this disk management utility most powerful and user friendly. That's why I showed up here. Here, I am going to show you OS migration process by using Easiest Partition Master Disk Management Utility. Note, its OS migration feature only available in paid version and its free version does not support OS migration feature. If you want, you can purchase Easiest Partition Master Pro Edition from their official website and install it like any other software. And note, before performing any major operation, it's always good idea to back up your important data. Once you have this disk management utility, follow these simple steps to migrate your operating system to a new drive. Connect the new drive to your computer. It could be an SSD or an HDD, whichever you prefer. Make sure you have a spare SATA, PCIe or USB port available for the new drive. After that, launch the ESUS Partition Master. The Migrate OS feature prompts you to choose the destination disk where you want to migrate your OS. Make sure you have the new drive properly connected to the computer. As you can see, this is my new drive. Now select Clone or Migrate OS from here or from going to main interface. As you can see, here is the list of various clone modes. Here, I'll be select Migrate OS mode to migrate Windows OS programs from the disk to another disk. Also, you can select Clone OS disk mode to clone all data on the disk containing the Windows OS to another disk and click on next. Then you will see a list of all drives and their partitions. Now select your destination disk that you want to clone to. Here I will be select my new drive which is disk 0 and click on next. Now Isus partition master will analyze your current system partition and the destination disk to ensure compatibility and proper migration. In the next window you can adjust the partition size and location on the destination disk according to your preferences. Here. I will recommend you to select clone as the source option. Once done, check the sector by sector clone box which is highly recommended. Before the migration begins, Isus Partition Master will display a summary of the disk layout. Review the information very carefully as migrating the operating system is an important task. If everything looks good, click on start to start the migration process. Isus Partition Master will now migrate your operating system to a new drive. This process may take some time depending on the size of your system partition and the speed of your drives. Please keep patience, do not interrupt the process. Alright, as you can see the message, partition copy completed successfully. Your new drive is now ready with all your files, settings and programs intact. Read the warning message about your source disk and target disk. Note, before you boot from your new target disk, don't forget to unplug your source disk from the computer. Now close the ESUS partition master and shut down your computer. After that, remove the old drive or change the boot order in BIOS settings to ensure that your computer starts up from the new drive.
Once your computer starts up, you can connect your old disk by using an external USB to set a PCI drive adapter cable to format. So, I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question or any advanced guide, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.